here we go for a dapper evening at the Edison. Ace and Megan, of course, the lovely Stacy. Let's go have a, a trip back in time. The Edison. So for those congolooshing at home, it was formerly the Adventurers Club. Now it is more sciencey, steampunk. The Edison. Let's go check it out. Ryan's already inside, scoping it out. In, in the 1960s, a NASA scientist invented ferrofluid as a form of fuel to try and find a way to fuel more rockets, right? What they found whenever this liquid was discovered, or invented I should say, is that it's highly, highly reactive to magnetizations. So as you can see, it reacts very strongly to a magnet. Now it also reacts to seismic activity, which means vibrations and things like that. So as you can see, whenever I kind of Whenever I kind of shake it like this, you can see there's little tiny ridges on the side that come to a point. That's because it's being reacted to seismically. It's, they're very, very quick if you see them. Yeah. So. It's like a horizontal like appendage. Yes, exactly. Exactly. So ferrofluid, it's very, very interesting in, in that sense. The coolest part about this particular substance is that whenever you take this substance out of water, it actually feels like sand. It, it takes on the characteristics as to what, other, what element it is within. So since it's in liquid form, it's in liquid form now. But if you were to take it out, it would feel like sand. It's very, wow, very interesting. Awesome. Um, take that end. All right. Now you take her hand, and you take his all the way around, and oh, touch okay. his skin. Nice. And... Oh! <laughs> nice. Now, what this shows is that this is a closed circuit. Open circuit, closed circuit. Now, it's interesting because electricity is constantly flowing through each one of our bodies at all times. Our heart actually emits a certain amount of electric, electric current. So, as we close this circuit, the electricity is literally flowing through all of our bodies, our hearts, and our minds, and connecting us all together. Kind That's of a cool force. Thing. Right, exactly. I will say the way they are, are displaying it is rather fun. It is is quite literally a clothesline of bacon. Yummy. Oh, that's good stuff. <laughs> that's good bacon. Delicious. Is that? Yeah, mine's gone. It's, it's delicious. Can I steal this clothesline from you? Of course. You want that? There's no more clothes on it. Oh, I'll, I'll take it. There's no more clothes on it. It's a good one. Thank you. No problem. General consensus, bacon is delicious. So what we have here is the girl cheese. It looks absolutely phenomenal. I'm already a little jealous. Stacy was going to get it, but then she didn't. She didn't for some reason. Uh, <laughs> there's the meatloaf. The meatloaf is looking great. The chicken is also, this is the fried chicken. It's like a cut apart drumstick of sorts. It looks kind of neat and interesting, also delicious. If the bacon has anything to say, it, it's all going to be delicious and it looks delicious. 